going on guys? So last night was New Year's Eve and I think this was our first New Year's Eve not doing anything. Welcome to parent life, Nikki and John. We just stayed in with Iris, we ordered some Indian food and we attempted to watch the Dallas Buyers Club and I fell asleep on the couch before midnight. Didn't even make it till midnight. <laughs> yep. Kind of way different from last year. You can go back and watch the vlog. It's called Epic New Year's Eve. Yeah, life is, is different now, but it's good. I enjoy it. I really like being a mom and I like having a family. So, I mean, I like the change. I'm sure eventually when Iris gets a little older, we may venture out a little bit into the nightlife every now and then. It's just not going to be a regular occurrence now. There you are. So cute. Chilling with Iris. Are you falling asleep? You look like my dad now. That's how he sits with her. Mm. I've been doing stuff all day. I all know day you have. Before. I We're know. pretty much moved in, though. Mm -hmm. We are getting there. So today I'm going to be pa uh, unpacking, not packing, unpacking a bunch of stuff, too. Putting some clothes in the closet. I have some hangers that we bought at Target last night so that I can put some stuff away. Doodle, I didn't even see that you were there, too. Yeah, we're waiting on that. We've got a new washer and dryer coming uh, tomorrow, so we're waiting to like for that so we can wash all our dirty clothes from our trip back to Minnesota. Yeah, I think like all my clothes are dirty. I've been living in pajamas. My pajamas aren't dirty though because I don't sweat very much when I'm not working out. I just showered too. Ooh, that felt nice to wash my hair. Let me tell you what. Still loving those hands, huh, Iris? I think she's getting a little hungry. Loving eating your hands? She's been eating a lot lately, Sooner too. Later, she's going to get that old fist in her mouth. <laughs> hey, baby Yeah, you're going to talk? you going to vlog a little bit? Sounded like she almost said, hey. I know. Sometimes I think she says hi. Yeah. She said N the other day. She was like, N. <laughs> I am like in this room now, I have to say. The couch is in here. I like the couches a lot. Well, I loved them in the store, and then when they brought him here, I was like, John, I don't know if I like them now that I see them in the room. And I always do that. John hates it. I like I always don't know that I like something when something's new, like when something's different. Because I just wasn't sure with the yellow. I mean, it's going to look better when we get curtains to match and stuff. But I really love these couches now. I think they are so nice. Beautiful couches. Aphrodite likes them too. Look at Aphrodite over there. John says this is what I get for saying your name. But I seriously, I took pictures and sent it to April, Andy, and my mom to get their approval. And they said that it looked nice too. Well, I trust Andy a lot. Andy's like really good at fashion. He actually, he owns his own fashion line and he, he has good taste. He knows how to pick stuff out. And Andy said that it looked good. I also wasn't sure because of how it was set up. It's not like symmetrical right in front of the window. You know what I'm saying? But I guess it... It still looks okay. It just took me a second to get used to. Whoa, living room. All right, so I'm gonna do a little work in the bedroom and try to get some clothes put away. Ugh, I love having some closet space. Now our dressers won't, won't be overflowing or anything like that. There's plenty of places to put clothes in this house. And then I've been putting some stuff away in the bathroom too. Little by little, well, I had two giant boxes full of stuff in here. So I definitely am making some progress, but pretty soon I'm gonna need to go to Ross or someplace. I wanna get a mirror for here, because this bathroom doesn't have a mirror in it. You gotta have a mirror in a bathroom so you can get ready. And then I need curtains for this window, because I'm pretty sure the people across the street can see me change in here and when I take a bath, um, I've taken a bath like the other night in here and I'm like, hmm, if the neighbors are out in the yard, I'm pretty sure they could see me right now. Better get some curtains so I'd be like trying to like duck when I walk by the window and stuff. <laughs> you gonna let me do this, miss? Not gonna put up a fuss? Gonna watch? Watch your mama? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Now look at that. All those need to be put away. Got a box full of shoes. And actually, the power isn't working in the bedroom, so we have to have an electrician come and get the power to work in here. It just works in that closet hallway and the bathroom, but the outlets and the lights don't work in here. What, what? Doodle, we're cruising! 
Right now, I'm on my way back to our old house. This will be my last and final trip down to North Hollywood to visit our old house. I have to drop off the keys and the garage door opener. Um, and then we will be officially moved out for good. Probably gonna have to stop and get gas at some point because I'm almost on empty. Um, but I don't know. It's very exciting to be moved out of our old house and into our new house. Wow, well, it's done. You know, I got my money back from the deposit that I had to put down and stuff like that. So, uh, there was actually a lot of people. There was like four people that were working on the house, working on the outside, the inside. Um, my landlord was there. So I didn't film any of the house, um, you know, but everything's taken care of, everything's done. I'm gonna head back home. Today should be really exciting. It's the Rose Bowl. Uh, today in Southern California, and we live near the Rose Bowl, and they have the B-2 bombers fly over uh, the Rose Bowl, and you can hear them from our new house. And sometimes you can see them. They always come from different directions. Um, every year, it's just a you know it's a different flight path. But we will, from what I hear, we'll be able to hear the B-2 stealth bomber go over, and we might get a chance to see it, which would be just awesome. Because let me tell you what, they are uh, the definition of American air superiority. Ha! Is the long-range B-2 stealth bomber. It's crazy. They're so awesome and so epic. And I just hope I get to see it because I've never seen one and I hear they're just crazy. I mean, they're like a billion dollar plane and that's crazy. That's how much like some ships are. And ships are gigantic and they do all this stuff and go over the world. But the B-2 stealth bomber is really hashtag America. Sorry, you got a little confused there. Everyone was in the house. You wanted to go in and you were like, hey, this is my house, but uh, there's our stuff is not here. Okay. Guess what John just did? I thought I was home alone and I was changing Iris in the bathroom and then he jumps into the bathroom and goes rah and I screamed so loud right in front of the baby. I was like oh my gosh way to go you can't just make me scream in front of her. Poor thing. John you idioto. Hmm. Maybe this could go here? Yeah, that'd be fine. There's a couple of them you have up that I'm not too happy with. Like what? Like the, you know what, the like paintings what? that I don't want. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. You said you loved them all. You wanted more ducks. <laughs> no more, more ducks. More no more ducks. He's getting, he's putting up like all these hunting paintings. Uh, hunting? It's like hunting Nobody's stuff. Nobody's shooting the ducks, they're just ducks. It's fine. They're like pictures that my dad would have in his house, or he has very similar things in his house. Well, he has very good taste, excellent taste in <laughs> pictures. I just, I would like the house to look a little nicer. Not, not like, not like a dude decorated it. You know what I'm saying? Like these, I don't want these fish and duck pictures hanging up everywhere. Voila! Getting stuff situated. I don't know what we're gonna do with this area. We'll that figure it out. Probably going outside. Well, yeah. Well, I we didn't know. want the dogs on the couch anymore. Well, I kind of want to keep this half of the couch so Kenobi does have a couch to lay on, so he doesn't lay on the new ones. But, but I don't want it inside. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we could put half outside and half inside, but I think it's a better solution or alternative than him always like trying to lay on the new couches and laying on when we can't. Like, because if he can, he will. At night or during well, the day. Well, the pillows will prevent them from laying on it. But if we forget to put them down or something like that. Yeah, I, I miss the B-2 bomber flyover. <laughs> Random. Like, while well, I was talking about it on my way home, I was really excited. Like, they're badass. Excuse my French or my America. But I missed it, and I'm so disappointed. Sorry. Yeah, I guess that's fine. It's a little yeah. high, but we're tall people, so I like to be able to be like... <laughs> what? Yeah. Well, well we gotta we gotta put them up. Well, no, we gotta put them up to like look nice in the hall. Like eventually, I want to fill this whole hallway with pictures. Well, you do, like, and go viruses, all the way down. Baby yeah. And the next It'll one, be like and the next family one, pictures. And the next one, like like a series of ages of pictures. It'll be very nice. So we're making a grocery store run. We have no food in the house basically, and John and I have decided that we both want to lose some weight. So we're gonna get some food that's like healthier, good for you type stuff. We're gonna eat that. Makes you lose weight really fast. Drink it. Yep. What is that? <laughs> Cleaning products? For the dishwasher, yeah. People might think I'm serious too. Don't, 
don't drink dishwasher stuff, you will die. I'm gonna grab some bread for sandwiches. See, I can't cut my calories too much though because I'm breastfeeding. So I gotta, if I wanna lose weight, I gotta do it very smartly. Oh, you, hey, I didn't see you there. Oh, really? Uh, chicken legs, chicken thighs, and chicken breasts. Well, like, breast is what's gonna help us lose weight. So chicken, chicken in general is good. Okay. No matter white or dark, doesn't matter to eat. Okay, jeez. And we can like cook half of it and freeze half of it, so it's good to always have like chicken. We're gonna try to do a lot more fruits and vegetables. We're getting some canned stuff. We're gonna get fresh stuff over there too, but we figured it would probably be okay to have some canned stuff too, especially if we don't have fresh fruits and vegetables just to keep. Mm, green beans. What, is that funny? Is that funny? She sits there and she like laughs at me when I vlog. All of a sudden I'll hear like a <laughs> Now it's time for the fresh fruits and veggies. Wow! Oh, it's glory. I want some sweet potatoes for sure and some yummy fruits. You're laughing at me again. You think I'm so funny when I vlog, but then when I turn the camera to you, you stop. She laughs at me when I vlog. That's because mommy's fun. <laughs> I'm gonna get some raspberries. These look good. Okay, I'm getting the spring mix for my smoothies and some sweet potatoes. Think we're good? Pretty much. I think this should do. The thing that sucks about fruits and vegetables though is that it goes bad so fast. So I don't want to stock up too much. I can always just come back to the grocery store. But does anyone know why raspberries mold so soon? I feel like raspberries are the fruit that molds the soonest out of all the fruits. Like you have to eat raspberries within a day. And we're good to go. We stopped at the coffee bean that was in the grocery store. And you guys, this is my first caffeinated beverage since I found out that I was pregnant. I got myself a tiny little chai latte. I am gonna be up all night. Whoa, wired. John spilled dinner. Nothing to see here. Way to go. Nothing to see. <laughs> he fumbled the rotisserie chicken and dropped it on the stove. Butt fumble. Butt fumble? What? Yeah, that's a football play. It's like one of the worst football players plays ever, the butt fumble. Look at this, guys. We got a nice cabinet to put our food in now. I like how they pull out so you can like, see what's in Yeah. Check it out. We're living in a fancy world now. Much fancier than what we're used to. We got pull-out thingies in our cabinet. Actually, you know what else we're really excited about? This house has a dishwasher. We have been living without a dishwasher for like five years now, for a really long time. Even our house in Corona didn't have a dishwasher. It had a wine cooler but not a dishwasher, you know, priorities. <laughs> but here it is, we have a dishwasher to wash our dishes. Woo -woo. I also bought some high shoes at the grocery store because of Katie and Colin vlogs. And I just tried one and they're actually pretty good. Iris is sleeping over here. She fell asleep in the car on the way home. All right, so there is dinner. I got it all ready to go. Nick is in the other room doing something. She's gonna come out and she's gonna be like, oh, you're so sweet. And I'm gonna get little baby Iris. We don't just, oh, I think I woke her up. Crap. Thor and baby Iris. So we're just sitting in our little breakfast nook having some dinner. Got some chicken and peas. And John has some chicken and green beans. He made green beans for both of us. But I don't know. I think green beans are just okay. I don't like them that much. I like peas better than green beans, so I just made myself some peas. And then we're having Iris for dessert. And we have dogs all over begging for chicken. Hey, Lola. <laughs> she, she can't take her eye off the chicken John has. We have a doodle under the table and Aphrodite begging to. So I just realized I should give Iris a bath. She's overdue, you know, with traveling and everything. So I am going to do that. Just getting our bath ready for her here. Hello, Mr. Boo. Are you curious? You want a bath? 
We put you in there? Oh, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. My arm is all wet now. We're actually gonna have to have a plumber come out because the shower sprays when you turn the bath on. She's actually starting to like baths more. She used to just cry the whole time and she hasn't done that the past few times I've given her a bath. They're more fun now, huh? Because you get to kick and you get to make big splashes. Isn't that lots of fun? Isn't that lots of fun? Woo! Splash, splash! Splash and you kick! Kick, kick, kick! Lots of splashes. Look how curly her hair is after she gets a bath. Cozy, you snug? Yeah, you're okay. Now I'm gonna attempt to put more clothes away. Well guys, I made a lot of progress. I put a lot of stuff away and now I've got Iris sleeping. So I'm going to wrap up this vlog. I'm going to attempt to finish Dallas Buyers Club. John's gonna join me in a bit because I fell asleep last night before he did, or before he sh shut the movie off, before he paused it. So I'm gonna try to catch up to where John was, but Please give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe, and always remember that I love you and stay tuned for more vlogs. Mwah.